Good morning everybody and welcome to the Retreat Centre for the Oblates in Worcester near Crewe. My name is Anne Walker and I'm a member of the Friends of St Eugene here. May we start with a prayer and perhaps we can pray to Our Lady for peace in the world. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Today's Gospel is taken from the Gospel of St Luke, chapter 12, verses 49 to 53. Jesus said to his disciples, How I wish it were blazing already. I have come to bring fire to the earth, and how I wish it were blazing already. There is a baptism I must still receive, and how great is my distress till it is over. Do you suppose that I am here to bring peace on earth? No, I tell you, but rather division. For from now on a household of five will be divided, three against two, and two against three, the father divided against the son, the son against the father, mother against daughter, daughter against mother, mother-in-law against daughter-in-law, daughter-in-law against mother-in-law. The Gospel of the Lord. While I was preparing this reflection, um, it was a work in progress. But through prayer, I was able to see, I think, what Jesus meant by setting the, the world on fire. I began by thinking of a furnace, burning and glowing, and by the heat sending the impurities for them from the items into the air. Jesus, I think, wants to set the world on fire by purifying our souls of impurities. This is only possible if we allow God's purifying love to consume us. Jesus wants us to be consumed by the fire of his love. He wants us to be engulfed in his love also. He wants us to transform us so that people can see the love of Jesus in our hearts. So today, let's kindle that fire. Pope Francis has asked us tomorrow to pray for peace, for peace in the whole world. He's asked us to pray all day as much as we can by visiting church, benediction, mass, whatever we can do during that day. So I ask us to pray now to Our Lady, Queen of Peace to guide us and help us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Thank you.